Hello, hello. <clears throat> Lady D. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? I'm doing uh, <laughs> great. <laughs> <laughs> great. What happened yesterday? I had a lot of work, so I couldn't connect. Just oh, okay. I yeah. See. But here you are, and that's that's important. Yes. Okay, Gustavo and Laura. Good evening. Good, good evening. Hey guys, how are you feeling? Yeah, so good. Feeling good. Yes, I just arrived in my home right now. Home, sweet home. Yeah. Friday, TGI Friday. Exactly. <laughs> I think students are studying the list right now, the vocabulary list. That's the reason why they are not connected yet. Hello. Okay. <laughs> I thought I had some problems with the audio, but no. <laughs> no, no, no. I was uh, trying to check, but in the group, but it seems like the connection is not so good. Good evening. Hello, good evening. How is it going, Fabio? Fine. A bit. Um, well, I'm. I went today to uh, a clinic mm -hmm. because I have a weird thing here in my eye. It says um, uh, hemorrhagia. Hemorrhage? Wow. Hemorrhage. Yes. Like here, very, very high. <laughs> yeah, that's not so common, I think. Yes. <laughs> but everything is fine. But you're, uh -huh, that's what I was going to ask you. If the doctor said that it's not too bad. It's not too bad. Uh, I will need to use some glasses because I, it's kind of not related or maybe because I have some exams to do yet. Some but exam, they yeah. say it's, it don't seem to be a worried thing, but they need to see, they need to still check to be with, with those exams mm -hmm. if everything is really okay. Okay, got it. Well, God willing, everything will be okay. Let's hope. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so as Gustavo was saying, TGIF. Yes, TGI. Do you, do, you, do you know do you know the meaning of TGIF, guys? I will write it in the chat, okay? T G T G I F. F. If you don't know, you have to Google it. <laughs> Thanks God it's Friday. Thank God it's Friday. That's right. Thank God is Friday. Yes. Okay, so Friday smells like the weekend's coming. I can sleep a little bit more. I can relax a little. I can do other things uh, that I like, right? That good I evening. Don't... 
Hello, good evening, Janari, Roxana, Floor, Blanca. Good evening, teacher. So uh, obviously it's a moment, right, for yourself, for you to relax, to have fun, to spend time with people that you love, right? And try to disconnect, right? It's also a, a time to disconnect from the virtuality that we live nowadays. Um, and somehow, somehow from work, for some people it's possible, for others it's not too much, but yeah, usually the weekends are a little bit less stress, stressing, let's say, or stressful than the, the weekdays. Now, um, but we're going to talk about that in a moment, okay? So, um, I don't know what's going on. I'm going to send another, I'm going to send a message to the group. So I'm going to start by asking each of you what your plans are for this coming weekend. If there is something in particular uh, that you are planning to do. So, uh, for example, in my case, uh, it's not something really fun, but I have to go to the dentist tomorrow. And uh, but after the dentist, I'm planning to to go out with some friends. So, uh, and that's in La Union. So I, I am going to see some people from, from there and also some relatives. So that's the plan for tomorrow. And on the weekend, I, I, I think I'm going to be working at some home repairments or let's say home improvements. That would be the best word. Some home improvements. Um, so it will be a very interesting Good weekend evening. for me. Good evening. What's your plan, Diana? In my case, tomorrow I have to work until 1 p.m. But in the afternoon, I think I just want to watch Netflix okay. and wait for Saturday because I'm going to be along with the pets because my husband has to, to travel. So okay, okay. Stay at home, yeah. Home alone. Yeah. <laughs> but don't be like the, like the guy in the movie, okay? Macaulay Culkin, that, I think that was his name. <laughs> yeah. You're going to turn your house upside down. <laughs> Diana, it's, it's not in the room. I don't know how she does it, but... She's invisible. Yeah, she has a special power to become invisible. Yeah, just finishing the dinner and I'm going bon to appetit. turn on the, the camera. Yeah, I just had dinner about, I don't know, like 20 minutes ago. So, yes, I understand you. Yeah, I came home a little bit late today. Uh, so, the next volunteer that I will choose is Fabio. What's your plan for this weekend? Hello. Uh, for this weekend, Yep. Tomorrow, well, in the morning, I will, I will, uh, go with my sister to the gym, but I will only left her that. Ah, <laughs> you're not going to, there. You're going to leave her. I, I will. I will. I will not exercise. I will not. I I will not have the just uh, exercise tomorrow. Okay. Uh, but in the next to that, I need to do some some house work, some chores <laughs> in the house. And in the afternoon, 
my girlfriend asked me if I can go to her parents for uh, lunch, so I will oh, go there. That's tomorrow. serious. That's something serious. <laughs> Good luck, Fabio. No, we go <laughs> there every weekend, like once a month. Ah, no, okay. no, every week, weekend, but once a month because she don't live with her parents right now, uh, but she wants to see at least see one. One, once a month. Once a month. Okay. Okay. Nice. So let's see. The next one will be floor. We don't know what happened with floor. So after floor, the next per ah, there she is. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Uh, my plans for tomorrow, well, I have to work all the day uh -huh. from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Uh -huh. So after my work, I hope come in my house and rest and lay down in my bed and eat and watch TV from tomorrow at night until Sunday. Wow. Okay. <laughs> That's a very <laughs> specific plan. Okay. Yeah. Thank you for sharing. Gustavo. Yes. I'm here. Is it gold? Is it a diamond? No, <laughs> because my 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 daughter uh, make um uh, I don't know this kind of things in resina for sale, being uh, for make uh, aritos and um, earrings. Oh yeah, uh -huh. uh, yeah, earrings, earrings and, and necklaces. I don't know pendant, pendant, uh, right? Earrings, uh, earrings for the ears in the. Uh, you say uh, necklace. Necklace, exactly. Necklace, yes. uh -huh. necklace. Yeah, in resina. So this this thing I I was watching. So tomorrow um, in the morning, I need to go to the uh, office mail because I have package uh, that arrived, that just arrived um, mm -hmm. after uh, make the, um, the food, the lunch. Uh, and the afternoon, I was thinking uh, playing video games almost all the afternoon. Okay. In the evening, in the night, also uh, until very very late in the night. So Sunday is for sleep almost until eleven or twelve p.m. Yeah, and after sure. make a food again. So my 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 weekend is almost the same. Okay, uh, but I need work the Sunday in the afternoon because I need finish a, a, a quotation for the bank of, of the government. Ah, okay. Yeah. Um, what do you mean by quotation? Quotation is like a cotization. You mean uh, like uh, when you're trying to an estimate, ah, uh -huh, quotation, exactly, quotation, quotation or estimate, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. And about the word that you were asking, I I looked it up and it's resin. Resin, resin, resin yeah. yeah. This resin. kind of earrings. That is. So, this is oh, that's really creative. Yes, Give, dame otro. Is in the end, it's like this. You see. What's the final product? Uh, yeah, I try okay, to show you, okay. but get it closer. Okay, there you go. Yeah. yeah. Wow, it looks like, beautiful. Yeah. I think you will have some potential customers here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like it's Diana, amazing. you see? She's, yeah. she's already see considering that. One, yeah. And the other one is like that. It's like this. Wow. Really, really beautiful. Yeah. And it's yeah. with the dog with a dog paw. Look exactly. at that. Exactly. Yeah. And this for is the large. pet lovers you see that's mm -hmm. an idea to improve your business pet lovers yeah. <laughs> you can you can give the customers a, a little necklace uh, as a souvenir 
yeah or downloading the app okay so <laughs> okay let's go on excellent thank you so much uh beatriz what about you um where where are you going i know you like to travel <laughs> yes uh on saturday i'm going to san vicente you see i know my students uh -huh, aha yes. you're going to san vicente where all the people go right but not yeah. me because i have never been to san vicente i don't know why but <laughs> i have to go there one day yeah yeah it's it's a nice city me neither yeah i don't know why i didn't but anyways um so that's your plan for the weekend you're going to san vicente with your family to yes. visit some relatives i suppose right no no i i would like to know new places ah okay so it's a new place for you too go to the lagoon is there a Excuse lagoon me? in san vicente yes ah i didn't know that i passed the peque. i went oh. i went last year okay so she already knows you see <laughs> she's a traveler definitely <laughs> the good thing is that your husband is a traveler too so your family is yeah that. Yeah. All my family like to visit new places and know uh, places or interesting places in El Salvador. Excellent. Okay, so yeah, promote local tourism. That's really good. If yeah. you want to travel to another country, then you can contact Flor. Now, after exactly. the after, after the commercial, we continue with the next volunteer. <laughs> uh, so, Miguel, what's the plan? Hi guys. Hi, Hello. Good, evening. Good, evening. good evening. Thank you. Uh, well, my plans for tomorrow mm -hmm. uh, in the morning uh, just work uh, from 8 to 12 p.m. In the afternoon, I, I think I visit uh, my father because um, I I just want once um how do you say una vez a la semana? Once, once a, week. a weekend. Once a once week. A week. Yes. Once a week to visit uh, the house. Uh, and and Sunday we we have plans for a trip. Uh, I think we go with my family uh, to the beach. Um, because in the, the last vac vacation, I don't go uh, visit the uh, place because it's a uh, full of people, for example. And after the party, mm -hmm. uh, after the uh, party, uh, I, lost hope, uh, I think it's, uh, it's a long little the places because it's, it's, we have the plan for tomorrow uh, Sunday. Perfect. Thank you so much for sharing. That's a good, that's a really interesting plan, a family plan. Okay, <laughs> yes, the next one will be Francisco. Um, good evening. Hello, good evening. Um, in my case, for tomorrow, mm -hmm. uh, my job is uh, Waiting, esperando me. <laughs> waiting for you. Waiting, it's, wait, it's waiting for waiting, me. Yes, waiting for me. Uh, may, uh, 7 a.m. to 4 p.m. is all day. Mm, for the Sunday, I have an invitation to my mom for my mom. Okay. Uh, uh, we have a, a invitation for it tamales. For it in tamales. Okay. For it in tamales. Yes. In by all the class, Francisco. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, he will send us a picture of the tamales, I think. <laughs> okay. Yes. It's a virtual invitation, right? Okay, thank you so much, uh, Francisco. <laughs> Good evening, Jackie. Welcome, Diego, Mariela, Jennifer. 
Hi, teacher. Okay, so we already have uh, almost everyone here, so we're going to move on. Uh, we were trying to catch up a little bit with the plans that we have for this, uh, this weekend, right? So uh, later on, you're going to have a, mo a moment, right, to continue talking in the breakout rooms. So we're going to listen to one more volunteer. Who would like to share about the weekend plans? Anybody who's missing, who wants to share with us? If not, we're going to get started with Fun Friday. So uh, as, as you already know, right, we have some pending things to do today. Uh, I'm going to be asking you some questions, right, about the, the vocabulary list that you studied. And uh, we are going to complete some exercises and some contents from the manual as well. So first of all, uh, what did we do yesterday? That's the first thing that I need you to share or to remember. Um, I will share the screen with you. Okay. Mm, yeah. Is it right here? I'm going to. Okay, there you go. Ready, set, and go. Okay, so uh, indirect questions. That's something that we will try to do today. Uh, what are we doing today? We're just reviewing the class, and we're going to talk about advantages, uh, disadvantages. Well, many advantages of prototyping, as well as. Uh, developing the little spelling B we have, okay, planned for today. So um, that's it. Now, what is a, a game that people usually play? I was taking the attendance as you were speaking, so don't worry, I already did that. Uh, what is a game that you used to play in classes on your notebook? when the teacher was not looking at you or when you were during the break. Do you remember one game that you used to play on the notebook when you were at school? Tic -tac -toe. Stop. Stop. Stop used to be one, but for, for stop, you need to speak, right? So one that you had to do in a silent way. Tic-tac-toe. Tic-tac-toe, that's correct. So uh, tic-tac-toe was a, a very, well, it's, it's, it's not was, it's a very popular game. Nowadays, the new generations don't play it too much, but in the past, it used to be popular. It used to be popular. I don't know what's going on, right, with the world. So, um, so for this, we're going to simply just- Play, the students play parties. Parchisa, something like that. Ah, true. They play that. They play that. But it's, I mean, nowadays it's more about video games than traditional games. Yeah, they don't even they don't even know how how to play the top. How to maybe spin, for how they to spin the top. That's a traditional play game. Yeah. True. For them that yeah that's what's common right that's what's common for them so things have changed and we cannot do anything about it just what you can do is to teach your future generations right your children how to how to play those games so uh because in the present it's i mean it's something that it's a tradition that is getting lost i would say people are forgetting about that okay so um uh, I am going to give you the indication, just try to pay attention, right? Uh, it will be very simple as something that we have been studying in the previous session. Uh, and that I told you that it's necessary that you learn by heart. What is something that I told you that you have to memorize in English, that there is no secret to learn, but to memorize? Verbs in past participle. Which verbs? Irregular 
irregular verbs, correct. So what we're going to do here is something really simple. You will play in the in the breakout rooms, okay? But you are going to play independently, right? You're going to decide um, which verbs, okay? Which verbs to use. So for this, the dynamic or the indication is the following. You are going to decide, right? Uh, who goes first, who goes first, okay? Um, and in your mind, okay, you are go or like you don't have to write it. Uh, you are going to name or well, not name number, number the squares. So, for example, this square is going to be number one. This one is number two. This one is number three, and you go from the top to the bottom, right? So this will be number four, and so on and so on and so on, right? Uh, so let's suppose that this is number five. We go. We're, I'm going to do one example, okay? I'm going to play with somebody here. So who wants to play against me? Ten, 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 ten. Me. This is your. This is your moment. Me, beat, Gustavo. To, to beat the teacher. Okay. Thank you, Gustavo. So this is going to be number nine. Okay, and that's it. So um, what you're going to do, I am going to share the screen, right? With a, with a, with a blank, with a blank uh, grid. So you can take a screenshot later. So what you're going to do is just to uh, choose a number. Okay, in this case, I don't know if we can do rock, paper, scissors, Gustavo, the winner st starts. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, ready? Rocks, paper, scissor. Okay, you win. So um <laughs> you start. Uh, choose a number and you are going to conjugate a verb, an irregular verb in English. If you conjugate it well, you get the number and you mark, right? I don't know if if you want to start with the with the with the X or with the O's, with the cross, right? Or the nuts. Um so yeah okay 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 choose a number me the first number yep you start uh seven okay seven conjugate one irregular verb uh irregular verb yeah in english yeah i was in blank um I was watching TV. No, just conjugate the, the forms of the verb. Ah, so only the form. Yeah, only the forms. Ah, okay. Is the um, irregular verb. Ah, wait. Irregular verb. Spoke. Speak. No, I speak, I speak, I spoke, and spoken. Okay, correct. So in that moment, you are going to, you can use the annotations. Okay, I'm going to resume the sharing. Wait a second. Uh, it's right here. I'm going to resume sharing. So this is, okay, this is the one. So you can use the annotation and mark, okay, the, the number seven. Where is the annotation there, here? You got it? No, I don't know what is the annotation here. Okay, if uh, which one are you going to use? X. X. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to help you out. So one person can do it, right? Of the of the two. So in my case, I'm going to draw it. I'm with this right here. Okay, so I go with the number uh, five, and I will conjugate the verb go went and gone so go go went gone go, okay there you go went, done. Okay. now your turn which one it's just with the irregular verbs just irregular verbs yes irregular verbs. don't use the list don't use the list no internet you have to refer only the ones that you remember never teach if you if, 
Huh? Or teacher is easy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I yeah, was no, but it, okay. Right? To make it to make it easier to make it easier for you, you can conjugate only two forms. Maybe the base form and the past, or the base form and the past participle. Okay, only one. I mean, only two forms: the base and another one. So, for example, you can say go and went, or go and gone, and that's it. Um, wake, walking, okay, and wake walking. and walking, walk and walking. Yeah. Okay, which one do you want? What number? Uh, one. Number one. Okay. Got it. Um, I'll go with number four. Uh, forget, forgot, and forgotten. Forget, forget. <laughs> what is it for the teacher? Okay. Uh, four. You know that nobody wins, so, okay? It's going to be hard, yeah. Um, do, we, do we declare it a tie? A draw game. <laughs> number. Or you want six. to try? Okay, you want to try number six. Uh huh. Which one? Uh, grow, grew, and grown. Okay, perfect. There you go. So, yeah, I think it's going to be hard for someone to win, but okay. So we can continue like that. Okay, but it's just a modeling. So it's just an example of what you're <laughs> going to do. I'm going to clear all the drawings. And now you can take the screenshot of the of this of the squares, right? Of the grid for the tic tac toe. So as it is from Friday. There you go. Now, uh, <laughs> so uh, that's just when I take the, the uh -oh. screenshot. Sorry. Take another <laughs> one. Take another. No, I'm just kidding. So uh, I am going to send you to the breaker rooms. That's what you're going to do. Okay. Um, and. You will play just one, okay? Just one uh, game, okay? Once you finish or one, once the time is over, I will take you back here. So for this, you will have exactly uh, four minutes, four minutes and I'm maximum five, okay? If I see that you're, everybody's playing with no problem, I'm going to give you an extra minute. So uh, we have 18, I'm going to create the breakout rooms for everybody to participate. So let me check. It, you will be, it will be in purse. So one, two, three, okay. One, two, one, two, one, two here. Uh, Laura, can you hear me? Diana, Diego? Yes, teacher, I'm here. Okay, you're here, excellent. Okay, now, um, let me see. Now I see, well, Yanari, is the connection good? Yes, teacher, but, but I have a problem with my internet. Okay, okay, I understand. I disconnect and connect, disconnect and connect. Oh, okay, so I'm going to send one more person to the breakout room where you are, just in case you lose connection. Okay, let me check. That would be the breakout room number four. Ready, set, and go. Okay, as a limitation. That would be number three. No, oh. I don't know what it's like something that I eat. It wasn't so good, but I don't understand what because I can turn on the camera. So if you want, you can start.
I don't know what we have to do. We have okay. to we have to uh, choose one verb of irregular verbs and we can we have to you can if choose I one. Win, I can choose okay. So the first uh, last I am the first by both. Okay. Uh, so I think there is no X. <laughs> No, you have to draw it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, a a gray grow written. Which number? Which two. number? Two number two. Two. Next two. to you. Yeah. Okay, my turn. Okay. Uh, a verb be, verb to be, a be, was a word, and been. Okay. Be. So, okay. if, if you want, you can start. Uh, you. Okay. Ladies uh, first. <laughs> Ladies uh, first, yes. <laughs> sing, sing, song, sung. Sing, song, song. Sing, sang, song. Ah, uh, sing, song, song. Sing, song, song. It's not sing, song, song, right? It's sing, sing sang, sang, and sang. Uh -huh. Yeah, sang. <laughs> okay. Yeah, sing, song, song, Dalila was sad okay so <laughs> okay mm -hmm. what number what number choose five it's your turn okay uh, uh, fit i i choose fit fit mm -hmm. fit uh, fit uh, Feed the feed feed your dog. Uh, feed the the no feed 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 the 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 fitness. No 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 the los pies. Oh feed. no, but it has to be a verb irregular. Ah, oh, perdón, perdón, no, sorry. Uh, feed. Okay, <laughs> the fitness. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. Sorry, teacher, I'm very nervous because he's driving at the same time. Oh, oh no, never mind. No, no way. Uh, Diego, I am going to send somebody here. Don't worry. Okay, okay. Okay, to play with Diana. You should have mentioned that. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. And you continue playing. That's... <laughs> but okay. with a scary moment. With yeah, that scary... was scary. Okay, I'm going to send Ma Mariela here. Okay, okay, thank you. <laughs> Hi, Mariela. Hi, Mariela. Diego is just going to listen us because he's driving. So if you want, you can start with the irregular verb. Mariela, can you hear me? She's driving too. <laughs> oh, no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, no. Okay, let me bring Janari here. Uh, oh my God. I was really worried. Yeah, I would be very worried too. Okay, I think Janari's here. Hey, Jessica Janari. Okay, can you yes. give me an irregular verb? Uh, yes. Okay. What number? Number two. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Number two. And the last one. Um, uh, we're war and warm. And, 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 the, and the last one, obviously. <laughs> Nine. Okay. <laughs> okay, good. So nobody wins. No, nobody wins. Okay, no, that was nobody. a tie game. That's good. Okay, so go for the second round. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody has okay. to win. 
annotate and annotate. Number one, Manny? It was number three. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna choose number two. <laughs> what was Number the two? What was same, the word? Same, same. Okay. I'm gonna choose number five. <laughs> uh -huh. The word is tell, told, and told. <laughs> so what happened? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> number one, number five. Number five, oh, please. and you win again. <sighs> Congratulations. He's good at that. <laughs> yes. <Yeah. laughs> good. You can tell that he was playing a lot in classes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there was another game that I remember that you had to, you wrote the numbers in different places and then you had to connect them with a line. Yeah, I was good at that too. <laughs> I don't know what was the what was the name of that. Uh, in Spanish. Uh huh. It was a tripachuca. Tripa. Chuca. Chuca. Ah, okay. That was fun. That was fun. Tripa <laughs> chuca. I used to play that game when I was at. School when I was in fourth grade. Okay, yeah, that was a lot of fun. I used to like it a lot. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, to make it complicated uh, for the other one. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Uh, are we going to play the game? Or? I think I'm going to call everybody back. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. Um, Hope that you liked it. <laughs> yeah, it was good. Okay, teacher, of course. Okay, now everybody's coming back. So we'll be able to continue. Show must go on. Now, um, I think that it was a little bit difficult in some breakout rooms because nobody was winning. So uh, there were two strong competitors playing there. Okay, guys, so welcome back. Uh, Oh. I hope that you had a lot of fun. Okay. Uh, Francisco is sharing a, game, a, a website where you can practice. So uh, actually you can play tic-tac-toe versus Google. I don't know if you have tried that on the internet. You just, in Google, you, you uh, yeah. type tic-tac-toe and then you start marking and the Google starts answering, the, I mean, playing against you. So it's pretty cool. Yes, in some places it's difficult to to win her. To win, uh -huh. to win. Mm -hmm. To win to the system. To the computer, I, yeah, exactly. I, it's like when you I, play chess or checkers, it's complicated. Yes, I try, but I don't know have any score. Uh-huh. But the system, everything uh megana with with me 
uh, beats me. You can say beats me. Beats me. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So uh, I'm going to beat you, right? So I'm going to, yeah, win. So in this case, we're going to move on. Uh, who won in your in your breakout rooms? Did anybody win any of the of the rounds? No. I'm going. I'm going to check. No. <laughs> So Francisco and Jennifer, Teacher, in, no one. In our case, Miguel win. Miguel won. Okay. Well, Francisco and Jennifer, no one. Blanca and Roxana. Not teacher because no. we were so. <laughs> one, one, no one. Uh, okay. No one won. Okay, Beatriz and Fabio. Nobody won. Nobody, Nobody. won. No one. Okay. Uh, <laughs> So in the end, everybody won because we were having fun, okay? So I don't remember. Raise your hand if you hadn't played tic-tac-toe in a long time. Yeah. Or use a reaction, yeah, okay. <laughs> so a lot of you, right? So it is good, right? From, from time to time to do something that you used to do when you were younger or when you were a child, just to remember, right, the good times. I mean, games are, are not, game, games are not just for kids. Okay, so we're young. Yeah, we're young for sure. I don't feel so young sometimes, but it's it's psychological, I think. <laughs> <laughs> it's stress. Okay, now uh, we're going to move on. Diana, uh, I don't know if you want to say something or you just raise your hand because you hadn't played. Oh, I, I forgot to lower the hand. Ah, okay, okay, no problem. Now we're going to move on guys. And what did we do yesterday? Uh, what do you remember from yesterday's class? What did we focus on? The prototype, we're talking about the prototype. We, talk, we talked about the prototypes and what else? What did we talk about the prototypes? What did we mention about them? Production line. The production line, we started the unit number three. Uh -huh. That was a production line. Uh -huh. Manufacturers. Manufacturers. Okay, so we saw some words. Mass, mass production. Mass production. Okay, correct. Did we practice any conversation yesterday? Yes, we practiced. Yes. yes. And yesterday was a special day for the boys. <laughs> yes. Do you remember why, Gustavo? Because... No, no, I don't. I, I don't say that. <laughs> we we lost. We lost because, because Diana was absent. Because no, Diana. Because, oh yes, Diana. We lost. The boys, yeah. Diana was the absent. Trivia. The trivia day. The boys. The boys. I more. can't believe that girls. Yes, we lost. Yeah. Sure. We miss and Diana. So we lost. But the game. But the girls. Or is my because own someone don't use Google. Someone this didn't, is the didn't reason. Use <laughs> Teacher, I never no, answer anything. What the guy Google? You see, you see what did now, you say? now, the guy now, say now, 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 this Who's to, to, to who answered who answered the <laughs> questions about <laughs> drinking? I was. Okay, okay, true. I was. Okay, so that With happened no yesterday. Google. I recommend you to watch the video. I recommend you to watch the video, <laughs> Diana. So uh, that was in, at the end in the last 10 minutes, I think, approximately. So you can watch the video, of the, the class video. So let's I go will on. do it. <laughs> okay, now we're going we, to move we on. Gave, we gave the chance to the boys, Diana. Don't yeah, worry. So they had hope. For the ha, ha, under control. Ha, ha. <laughs> the boy questions were easier than girls oh, questions. Oh wait, no <gasps> way. Yes, that's the reason. No so way. they they oh, won't. Yeah. That doesn't matter. Okay. <laughs> for your happiness, boys. Girl didn't Google today. <laughs> it, was, it, it was a gift. It was yeah. a gift. Okay, so <laughs> girls have a a big heart, and for that reason, they they let us. They let you win, right? Now, uh, <laughs> this is a little bit of what was happening uh, during the breakout rooms right now. So you see, okay, it was really tight. It was difficult for them to win. 
Uh, so let's go on and okay. I don't know what happened. I I heard my voice like an echo echo. So maybe it was Amelia talking to me. Now, uh, what we're going to do with the first activity is going to focus a little bit on vocabulary. So what are we doing for this activity? Freddy's, can you please read the indication? Yeah. <laughs> Ranks the advantage of prototype from most relevant. Number one, to least rele uh, relevant. Relevant. Yeah, relevant. Number six, discuss your ranking with a partner. With a partner. Okay, so this is an, an individual activity. So in your notebook, I need you to please write down. I mean, you don't have to write all the, the, the sentences, right? All the, the, the statements or the advantages. So what you, I need you to do is just to write down the numbers from most to least relevant. So in your opinion, which of these advantages is the most relevant, number six, I mean, number one, and the least relevant, number six. So in your notebook, right, on a piece of paper, write down the number. Imagine that they are organized, right? Uh, I'm going to label them so that you, um, it's easier for you to do it. So this is going to be letter A, wait. Going to move it a little bit here. This is going to be letter A. This is going to be letter B. This will be letter C. This will be letter D. Doesn't look so nice, but you get the point. And this will be letter F. So in your notebook, right, you're going to label this uh, in the order that you think it's the most to the least relevant of prototyping, the advantages of prototyping. So for example, I can, in my, in my mind, right, I can, or let's suppose in my notebook, I can say that the letter A is number three, it's in the middle, uh, verify the functionality, I'm going to say that this is number one, the most relevant for me. Uh, letter C, I think it's, um, I don't know, number four. Uh, the letter D, I think is the least relevant. So it's going to be number six. So that's what you're going to do, okay? Analyze the advantages and rate them or rank them, right? From one to six, from the most to the least relevant. Then I'm going to send you to the breakout rooms and you're going to discuss with your classmates, okay? Your opinions. I will give you two minutes maximum to answer this right now. When you finish, please raise your hand and leave, keep your hand up, right? So I know who is finishing. Okay, let's see how many people have right behind. No one, okay. Keep 
keep analyzing. As we mentioned in the previous sessions, right, the prototyping is basically creating a sample product of what you uh, so to be analyzed, to be assessed, to be evaluated, right? To be tested before you create, before you go to the mass production, okay? So with the prototyping, you make sure that everything is okay and you can say if, or you can make a decision if you, if the product is ready to be produced in large amounts or you need to make some modifications. In the meantime, I am going to take the second attendance of the evening. Roxana, are you there? Present teacher. Hey, Janari. I'm here teacher. Hey, nice. Fabio, well, Rolanda is not here, I think. I'm here. Fabio, yes, okay, Miguel. Here, teacher. Gustavo. Ouch, ouch. I'm here. I'm, okay. And I'm uh, eating. Sorry. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. Bon appetit. Jennifer. Thank you. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Harvin is not here. Um, Jackie. Present. Laura. Freddy's. Hey, teacher. Francisco. Present teacher. Floor. I'm here. Diego. I'm here. You're not driving right anymore, right? Oh no. Okay, thank God. I don't know. Huh? It's, it's raining. It's raining. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Diana. Brenda, Blanca. I'm here. Mariela and Beatriz. I'm here. Okay, perfect. So let's see how many hands are in the air. Okay, we have one, two, three, four, five. Okay, five people already finished. Okay, don't forget when you finish, raise your hand and keep it up. So I can see how I can count how many students are missing. This, I like this kind of activity because they make you think and then you have to discuss. So it's perfect for developing comprehension and production of the language. Okay, I'm going to give you 30 seconds more to, to finish. Let me count the time. Here we go. I think my dog wanted to say hi to you. But he left. Okay. Check and five, four. What is your dog? Three, two, one. Uh, he's right next to me right now. A small one. It's a medium. It's a medium size. It's a medium size. Okay. Good. So we got seven hands up. And right now I am going to send you to a breakout rooms be, with the following indications, okay? You are going to be working in groups of three, okay? So one by one, you can you need to share um, the, well, maybe the best way to do it so you don't have to be waiting for everybody to, to finish is that you go from the most to the least relevant 
for example, Freddie, what is the most relevant for you? And Freddie is going to say, ah, the most relevant for me is review initial product shapes or branding images. Okay, so then Freddie asks Fabio, so Fabio, which one is the most relevant for you? Uh, for me, it's elicit feedback from customers or early adopters. And then um, Fabio can ask Jennifer, right? So Jennifer, which is your favorite one? I mean, your favorite, the most relevant for you. And then she can say, ah, to assess the performance of various materials. So if in that moment you see that you don't have an agreement, right? It's like, okay, so why do you think that that's the most relevant? And so I guess that you're going to discuss probably the, the top and the bottom, right? That's going to be the main discussion. Um, and maybe the one in the middle. So you can discuss those three, right? Explain and give a reason why you think that's the, the most, why that the other one is the least and why the other one is in the middle. It's not too relevant, but it's not that irrelevant. So it's in between. So maybe you can make a discussion in that way, if you wish, um, or one by one, everybody's going to say the, the top from one to six, and then you can discuss about the answers. Okay, so um, basically just that, if, he, if it's necessary, you can take notes about your classmates numbers right the order of the numbers for them so later you can compare like okay so we have some similarities and we have some differences uh, is there any question about what you're going to do right now yes or no uh-huh no, no. no it's clear everything's clear like horchata right so here we go uh, I'm going to create five breakout rooms. So let me check that all the, to see if all the groups are complete. Okay, this is complete, this is complete, this is not complete. So I'm going to send one person here. And, hello? Make sure that there's no problems with the practice. What? Sorry? We are going to go to the breaker rooms. Yes. Uh, yeah. So Just you need to for... take a, a screenshot. Uh -huh. Oh, no, just make sure that that no one is driving in my in, <laughs> in my your group. in your group. Okay, got yeah. it. So uh, uh, nobody's driving right now, right? Guys? No. No. Okay. So nobody's driving. Not, not me, teacher. Hopefully. Okay, yeah. let me check. Okay, room number five has three members. It's okay. Group number four, three members. Group number three, three members. Excellent. Three and three. Yes, we're good. Ready to go. So how much time do you have for this? Good question, Emilio. You are going to have exactly, let me check, six seven minutes maximum to discuss your answers okay if you need more time i will give it to you okay so here we go everything in english everybody please express an opinion everybody needs to speak take turns and that's it here we go i set the invitation now Hmm. Okay, one, two, three, one, two, and to feel better than yes, today. I yes, I hope that. But I have a doctor appointment. Really? Yes. So I I know that I hope that I will get better. Sure. Okay. 
Okay, let's review the answers. Are you yeah. agree if I share the, my opinion yes. about the ah, I think that you will share yes. the explanation. I know. You want okay. to take a screenshot? No? Okay, yes. there you have it. You see? Take yes. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Oh, okay. sorry. In the case and of Mariela, she's not feeling well because of the vaccine, so she's as a listener right now. Okay. Okay. Thanks. I don't know if you agree with my... With your order, no. <laughs> I don't know, I don't have any of them in the same position. position. You have letter A. Yes. Yeah, yes. that is the letter A, Diana. The, that's what I say, it's the letter A. And Obtain the more detail. Teacher, how Hello. can we pronounce <laughs> effect, effect <laughs> How can you pronounce effectively? Yeah. Effectively. 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 Effectively, glee. Okay. Uh -huh. So you skip the yeah, sound and you say glee. Glee, yeah, okay. effectively. Thank you. Oh, Welcome. you put numbers. I put letters. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, I put numbers too. <laughs> no, the letters were just to have a reference, but you have to rank yeah. them uh -huh, with numbers. Oh, it's okay. Don't worry. The, the, the indications, the indication said, said From one, one to six. six. Or yeah. Yes, exactly. that's true. Yeah. What happens is that she's in love, so she loses concentration easily. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the number three, I... The potential manufacturer, I think uh, do, you can, you can see the, you can see the, the cost. And mm -hmm. if the quality, the product, in, in, then I will do is or making or make is uh, with the quality, uh, quality and cost. Mm -hmm. uh, it's my it's my opinion. Also, if if you don't, if the manufacturer can can make the product, it mm -hmm. would be possible <laughs> to <laughs> to finish it. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. Okay. Um, for me, the, no, the oh, number two. All different. <laughs> <laughs> all, all, all the three have different as number one. <laughs> but do we have like a <laughs> <laughs> like a ladder? <laughs> one shoes the B, other the C, other the D, just the F. <laughs> yeah. yeah. C, G, E, and F. Well, okay. and the and the, the second one. For the second one, in my case, I choose obtain more details to describe the product more effectively. Effective, effectively, 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 effectively. There you go. I and have this effectively. For me, what? is the verify the functionality of the product. The functionality. For example, mm -hmm. the letter B. The letter B, yes, the second. B. Mm -hmm. I have the same. Verify the functionality of the product. Okay, let's see. And Irma, what do you say? You have the number. I have the the same that you say. Ah, the, uh, the, the, yes, the the more detail. Yes. Two and two. Uh, we have two <laughs> and two of these. I choose <laughs> this one as two just because it was it, it, it has a it makes sense if I choose the second one, the V as first, just because that. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, 
Okay, the third, uh, I have access. I'm not sure uh, about the pronunciation. Access. 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 Yeah, access. 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 Okay. The performance, the okay. performance of various materials. Mm -hmm. I have that. Like number three. Right there. Yeah. It was like a kid, like 30 years old. Ah, you want to finish it because I was from Nacajutla. Many years ago, uh, I was uh, the the guys shooting me in, in a popa. Diana, Diana. <laughs> okay. well, well, I'm gonna say my numbers: two, five, okay. one, six, three, four. That's what I have. Two, one. No, no. Two five one six three four. Okay, I have two four one three five six. <laughs> I have two six one five four three. <laughs> 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 okay, number three. How we can make one decision? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Okay. Um, well. Two people have the number four in the letter B. Okay, we have to put that. Okay, uh, the, the number five, what do you have? I, I have letter B, Blanca. Okay. <laughs> We're fine. <laughs> I have letter B of Blanca. I <laughs> I have letter E of Stephanie for, because my name before I have review. Review initial product shape or branding. I had four in that. Okay. And you, Jennifer? Uh, says the performance of various materials. Okay. Assess. assess. Yeah, assess is okay. In number five, Francisco. Uh, the number. Yeah. For me, is a review initial product shape of branding images. Uh, what? Okay. What, what yeah. and the number six. Ah, I see the third one. <laughs> mm -hmm. okay, uh, I the have... last one. The last one. Okay, I have the number six. Uh, ensure potential manufacturers are capable of okay. making the prototype. Mm -hmm. I agree with I Roxana. Oh, excellent, Miguel. Can I have review initial, initial product shapes or branding mesh? Branding <laughs> image. That's what the mind was. A six, I have the Third one, review initial product shape for our branding image. image. Images. Images, yeah, images. But images. I, I think that is very complicated because I'm not sure about uh, the answers. Mm. Yes, I think it's, it's difficult. It's a matter yeah, of perspective. Because... This kind of exercise is about perspective. It's not exactly yeah. about who is right and who is not. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just to express your opinion. <laughs> we have finished. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We didn't agree in a few ones. 
Yeah. <laughs> like we have uh, in common the the number three. <laughs> Yes. Oh, yeah. This is the performance for material. Mm -hmm. And so, which one do you agree can be one of the most relevant uh, advantages of prototyping? One of them, one of the most relevant, in your opinion. What's the most? One of the most relevant. Um, the third one is well, almost the just three of the four agree in in assess the performance of <coughs> materials is at least in the top three of the advantages to us to assess assess the performance of various various materials okay And the number, two, number three. Also, the number two, uh, we have here two say one and, oh, one and the other two agree in other. So we have two. <laughs> in the top two, we have um, a different opinion, but we have as uh, number two, obtain more details to describe the product more effectively. And also, the other two choose. Verify the function the functionality of the product, identify flaws that were not foreseen in the design stage. Those yeah. two were I, selected for two and two. <laughs> yeah, I feel that the two of them are really are really relevant. Um, yes. Yeah, I think I might go a little bit, just a little bit more for verifying. The flying. Flaws, verifying the flaws yeah that's one of the main the main um objectives of the prototyping mm -hmm. yeah so we're going to check what the rest of your classmates say okay so here we are now um I am going to uh, just share an opinion, right, about about the the discussion that you have right now. So prototyping, uh, it's obviously something really important when you are creating a new product. Uh, but the discussion that you had was about which advantages are the most relevant. Okay, uh, so. In this case, uh, I am going to go one by one and you raise your hand, okay? According to the list, according to the list, I'm going to share it again. Wait a second. Okay, here it is. So raise your hand if you think that the most relevant is letter A obtain more details. I'm going to see which one has more, let's say votes or more points to be considered the most relevant. So letter A, nobody says that is the most relevant. Okay, number, I mean, letter B, verify the functionality of the product, I identify flaws that were not foreseen in the design stage. Who thinks that this is the most relevant? Who has in the in your list, in your rank, that you have that is the most relevant? Five participants say that this is the most relevant. Okay. It that's, means that's the number one. Aha, uh -huh, number one. Aha, uh -huh, that you think that is the number I mean, one. The second one is the letter number B. one. Aha, uh -huh. we're checking okay. opinions right now. Yeah, so okay. five people think that this is the most relevant. Okay, raise your hand if you think that the most relevant is letter C. Review initial product shapes or branding images. Okay, we have three participants that say that is this one. Okay, four participants. Now let's continue. Raise your hand if you think that elicit feedback from customers or early adopters is the most relevant. Elicit feedback from customers or early adopters. Raise your hand. 
Mm, according to this, only one person, well, two people say that is the most relevant and then continue assess the performance of various materials. Who think that this is the number one? Okay, Beatriz. Diana and Miguel, you have to lower your hands. Okay, Be Beatriz and Francisco say that is the most relevant. And the last one, Ensure potential manufacturers are capable of making the prototype, sourcing the parts, putting them together, etc. Who thinks that the letter F is the most relevant advantage of prototyping? No one. So the winner here, okay, this is voting, okay, this is democracy. The winner here is the letter B. Verify the, the functionality of the product, okay? Now, let's go to the opposite. Which do you think is the least relevant of the advantages of prototyping? Raise your hand if you think that the least relevant is letter A, obtain more details to describe the product more effectively. Nobody has that as number six? Okay, review initial product shapes or branding images. I think that this is the least relevant. So Jennifer and Fabio. So we have two opinions for this one. Three with Miguel. Okay, uh, next one. Elicit feedback from customers or early adopters. Elicit feedback from customers or early adopters. That is the least relevant of the advantages. Okay, four or five people say that this is the least relevant. Six people say that, okay. Assess the performance of various materials. Assess the performance of various materials. Who thinks that this is the least relevant? Three people. Oh, wait, no, just two. Now the last one, ensure potential manufacturers are capable of making the prototype. Who thinks that this is the least relevant? So, by majority, we are going to agree that letter D is the least relevant. Elicit feedback from customers or early adopters. So we're going to stay with these two because if we start checking one by one, we're not going to finish today and we have more things to do. So uh, in this case, I agree with you about the, your answers. I totally agree with you. This is not about who's right and who's wrong or who has more points. This is just to express your opinion. But yes, one of the main reasons why prototyping is good is because you can verify the functionality of the product. If it works or it doesn't work. If it has some flaws, some mistakes, some things to correct or to improve, that is the moment, okay? Um, and let me see the list. You think that is illicit feedback from customers or early adopters? Uh, I would say, I would say yes, it's between this one and um, maybe obtain more details to describe the product more effectively. Mm, I mean, the description of the product is not that relevant. So yeah, okay. so is between those two, okay, in my opinion. But in the end, everybody has different opinions. We don't have a company right now. We don't have a product to make a prototype of, so we don't have to worry too much about it. But when you create a product, remember these advantages. Now, we're going to move on, and as uh, pronunciation is important, I need six volunteers, okay? The first six people to raise a hand to read each of the advantages out loud through the microphone, okay? Diana? Beatriz, Diana one, Beatriz two, Miguel three, four, Francisco, five, Roxana, and number six. I need number six, one more, three, four, five. Gustavo, okay, thank you so much. So number one. Diana? I'll take my... <laughs> Obtain more details to describe the product more effectively. Effectively, that's right. So the word details 
or details, okay? Those, the two pronunciations are okay. Uh, details or details. If you ask me, I I pronounce it details more than details. details. I, I prefer details. Okay, now, uh, number two. Verify the functionality of the product. Identify flaws that were not foreseen in the design stage. That were not foreseen, uh -huh, foreseen, right? Foreseen. Do you have any idea about what foreseen is? No, teacher. No. No. So why don't you ask the teacher? Curiosity is something good when you are learning. Okay, if there is something that you don't know, teacher, what is that? Okay, so what is the meaning, Emilio? No, now it's too late. <laughs> now, okay, so uh, for C, for C is when you anticipate something, when you predict something, like you have the power to see the future for C, right? When people read your hand, for example, people who believe in that, right? I foresee that you're going to get married and have uh, three children. That's an example, right? What do you foresee? So foresee is to anticipate, to predict, okay? Uh, so good, floss, floss, that would be the, the plural. Very good. Number three, please, review. Okay, okay. review initial product, product shape of branding image. Images. Images. Image is singular. Images is plural. Okay. Mm -hmm. Review initial product shapes of or branding images. Okay. What is brand? What is brand? Just like this. Brand. No translation. What is brand? It's an aid that identify your product. Ah. For example, what is a famous brand? McDonald's. Yeah. McDonald's is a brand, yes. So McDonald's. Nike. Nike, very good. Adidas, right? Excellent. I love Nike, Nike's slogan, to be honest with you. Just do it. So it applies for a lot of things in life. Teacher, but I am afraid to participate. I am afraid to speak to people from other countries. The answer? Just do it. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yeah, just do it. Like teacher i don't know if i if i should continue studying just do it uh or if you say i don't know if i should tell her that i like her just do it um i don't know if i should marry next year just do it okay that's it it applies in a lot of contexts, but you have to be careful right don't apply that for everything uh <laughs> um there are some things that you have to, to think, um, let's say, thoroughly, right? Think twice or three times. Uh, connection problems. Oh, Laura, I'm so sorry. Try to stay as much as possible, okay? Or as long as possible. Number four, please. Illicit. Illicit. Illicit, okay. Illicit. Illicit feedback from customer or early adopters. Excellent. Number five. Thank you, Francisco. Assess the performance of various materials. Okay. So in this case, what is the stress? In a uh, or in stress? Iron short. Assess. Assess. Iron short, teacher. Okay. I'm going to give you a clue. Okay. So, what is the stress? As, uh, asses. Ah, it's so difficult. <laughs> it's the second syllable, not the ah. Asses. No, not the ah. Assess. Assess. Aha, the there you go. Of okay. the performance of various. Various materials. Materials. Excellent. Thank you, Roxana. And number six, I think it was Gustavo, right? Ensure potential manufacturers are capable of making the prototype, sourcing okay. the parts, mm -hmm. putting them together, etc. Etc. Okay, so what is the pronunciation of this word? Capable. Capable. Nope. Capable. 
Capable, that's correct. Capable. Uh -huh. Capable. 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 Okay. Ensure potential manufacturers, manufacturers, that's a long word, manufacturers, uh, are capable of making the prototype. Okay. So good. Excellent. Thank you so much. Claps for the volunteers, please. That's really good. The more you practice, the more you improve, the more you learn. So let's move on. Show must go on. Okay, I'm going to continue. So here we have the group work. So for this activity, what are you going to do? Floor, thank you for help me, helping me read the indication. Floor, are you there? No, we lost communication. Sorry, with you. yes. The microphone was. I thought she was sleeping. No, no, no. The microphone was off. Sorry. Okay, no problem. So, can you please read the first three indications? The okay. first three steps. Group work. Mm -hmm. prepare, prepare a presentation. Prepare an presentation. Go back to the new product description you create. Created. created. In unit one. one, that's right. Okay, Jackie, can you please oh continue God, with the I next guess. three? Not again, yes. <laughs> make a list, make the list of features as specific and detailed as possible. Mm -hmm. Brainstorm the materials needed to create the prototype. And the last one, list the benefits of building a prototype of your new product. Correct. Okay, guys, so for this, I'm going to give you 50 and 50. 50% 50 that you will advance right now, you're going to start. The other 50%, you finish it uh, during the weekend, right? Like, okay, you do this, you do this, you do this. And on Monday, we get together again in groups. You share the information that you investigated. You put it together in a document, right? You create a Frankenstein. Uh, and then you're going to present, okay, with the class. Right. This, is, this is very popular, right? Very common. Like, okay, so you do the introduction. I do the objectives. You do that, you do that. And when you put it together, is a Frankenstein because as you know, Frankenstein was made of different pieces. Uh, so it was, it doesn't look so nice, but it works sometimes. It works sometimes. So you are going to have just uh, five minutes to agree about what you're going to do, how you're going to do it, how you're going to divide the responsibilities. Then you uh, individually, you do your work. And on Monday, you, you will have a uh, 10 minutes, okay, to work together and put the information together and choose the volunteers, right, to present the information. So um, you can advance a little bit about, about, about the, well, with the information that you need. Maybe you can start with the characteristics of the product or brainstorm the materials that you need to create the prototype, right? So um, that includes, um, the money that you might need, right? How much money approximately you need for to, to buy the, the, the materials, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. For the quaternary mono, ammonium with fragrances, right? So like if you're going to create a bomb, you have a lot of chemicals and stuff. So um, that, I'm going to give you five minutes really quickly. Uh, then we come back. We are going to do the spelling competition, the spelling bee competition. And um, we're going to close, right, with, with today's class uh, with some final words, some final speaking, and that's it. So uh, breakout rooms, I'm going to create them again. So in this case, um, it's just four breakout rooms. So in the number one, I'm going to have the quaternarian ammonium. So who is in that group? Quaternarian ammonium. I think it was... Teacher. Jennifer, hello. I have a question. Teacher. No. Uh, Rolando, Jarvin, mm -hmm. Mariela, Diego, Brenda. Uh oh. So I think that you're not going to have a lot of partners today. 
Okay, Ariela uh, is here, and I think that we lost communication with Diego. Uh, Freddy's, what was your question? Yeah, my question is, it says, go back to the, to the new product description you create in unit one. So we already have the product. So we have to uh, make a new description or the same description? No, you already have the description. So what you're going to write down is some characteristics of your product. Okay, and think about what materials you need to create the prototype. Okay, so the benefits, right, of making a prototype for your product. So basically that. Okay. Okay. So if you already have the description from the unit one, you don't have to make it again. Okay. So Fred is your team. It's um, Jacqueline. Uh -huh. It's uh, Fabio. Fabio. Roxana. Roxana. And Janari, I think. And don't forget about Janari, please. Here, my Roxana. Okay, perfect. So, breakout room number three. We go with Blanca's team, that is find your pet. Blanca, who are you working with? I think you were working with. Yeah, Diana and. Francisco, Francisco, Miguel Angel, and Juan Jose. Okay, Juan Jose is not here right now. So we continue with the last team. So in the last team, we have the two Anas, uh, Flor, Gustavo. Are you working in the same team as Flor? Yeah, uh, with Flor, uh, yes. Okay. And Blanca, Diana, I think Janari was. Yanari was in your group, right, Freddy? Yes. 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 Okay. Perfect. So I'm going to add her here. And in the so the, the group number one is alone. Okay, they don't have a, a lot of people. So uh, I'm going to be with them just for a moment. So five minutes beginning since the moment that you enter the breakout room. Okay. You can take a screenshot of the indication. This is on uh, the manual, right? Teacher, can you send me the invitation again, please? Who's speaking? What speaking? number floor? Number four, four. 26. Okay, wait a second. This is on page 26, okay? Don't forget about it. Okay, give me a second. Number four, number four. Okay. Wait a second. Number one, then I'm going to move you to the room number four. Okay, I said the invitation to join the breakout room, please. Francisco, Blanca, Janari, are you there? Hello, girls. Hi, teacher. I am part of your team today. Okay, teacher, thanks. So, um, where, what do you have? The any information about your product? I will Google. 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 Yes. Why are you going to Google? I will look. Um, well, it's just um. A, a couple of components. Components. Oh, okay. So you're working with the... Which... Ammonia Quartenaria. Oh, yes, definitely. You are the most scientific one here. Yes. <laughs> it is. And I will do it step by step. Yeah. Okay, so you, go, you can go in Google. I'm going to check the other breaker rooms. If you need any help, let me know. Okay, teacher, thank okay. you so much. You're welcome. See ya. New product description. Come. What do we need in 
I yeah. don't know what that is. Bye. No teacher. Yeah. Well, okay. in, That's possible. We were talking about um we we put in the app so we already make some description in the app mm -hmm. about the features. Yeah. And we you say okay the ones we have we well. make them because we need them to the questionnaire just because some questions are were open wow. end and need uh -huh. to know <laughs> More the features. So that's right. <laughs> we didn't know we <laughs> We'll end up using them. <laughs> I don't know. We are talking about if with these are. I think this is the thing the the exercise say. Yeah. So now we have to brainstorm the materials needed to create the create the prototype. Mm -hmm. What materials do we need for an app? That's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Well, <laughs> prototype for an app is a prototype or is kind of a model or a, I don't know for um, for software things. For software, they use words they as use, uh -huh. beta or something. Yeah, like that's that. that's what I was thinking that they alpha they beta and they don't like use, they don't use uh the same words the same vocabulary. They use for when they are very in the very start, they call them alpha. Yeah. And when it's almost in the end, they call it beta. 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 Okay. So for this, the material, I think it's my of the materials to create. The alpha, I think, because the alpha is more a pro the two of them are kind of a prototype. Mm -hmm. The one that I'm more familiar with is with beta. I, I beta, didn't know beta. that they use alpha. Uh -huh. The alpha uh, is a beta version, they say beta version, uh -huh. beta, beta version, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, we will do the beta, beta, beta. beta. Beta, beta is British uh, in British. British. Yeah, uh, beta is American. And then okay. you can uh, dis dis discuss like what are the benefits, right? Of creating a prototype for your app. Okay. A beta version. Mm -hmm. Different what? Different prices. Different prices, yes. Prices. Okay. Price. Okay. Price. And what materials we need if we because the one is, is, is a little bit blind for us. <laughs> the second one the se is what the second one? You take the, the screenshot. Eddie, fuera. Sorry, guys. Beatriz, you, you, you took the screenshot. I'm going to look okay. up. Let me see. There you have it. Descriptions you create number one, make a feature specific and details. Mm -hmm. Okay, features and specific and details as possible. Brainstorm of the materials needed to create a prototype. But we can't create a prototype because it's a plan. But you can create a sample. A sample. Yes, we can, we can offer like teacher. How do you say? Or different samples. How do you say uh, like in Spanish? Líneas. Line. For example. Product line. Product line. Product line. Product line. For example, if I want to say in uh -huh. Spanish, uh, la línea de macetas uh, plásticas. Or la línea de macetas de cerámica. Yeah, you can do that. Or la línea de macetas decoradas or, or something like that. Yeah, exactly. That's that's where you, it's a line, it's a product line. So you have the, for example, the cactus line, you have the succulents line, then you have the decorated flower pots line, and then you go like that, okay? So in your case, it would be more like a demo, right? That, than 
creating a, a prototype. Maybe like the presentation of, of the product, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So we got the presentation. One more minute. Make the list of pictures. Mm -hmm. One more minute. Okay. So you may you okay. get to an agreement and distribution and goodbye. Siri, serial, serial or Siri number? What? Serial Siri. number. Siri. Siri. Yes, yeah, serial number. Serial. Serial number. Serial yes, number. to similar one. BPN number. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. something like that. Yeah, yeah serial number. Or... Serial number, okay. Mm -hmm. And it's going to be, it's going to have an unique serial number. Okay. Then that can be, okay. can be the way to rush to. your pet. Okay. Uh, any idea of what it's the materials that we need to create the prototype? For your app, it's not exactly because, a prototype. I think it's more like a no, because a we have to we have to do a prototype of the dispositive and the, the app. device. Ah, mm -hmm. the device yeah. and, and the, the app. app. Okay. Because it, it's it's mm -hmm. relate each other. It's related. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. So I'll okay. see you soon. Okay, we, we finish and, and didn't yes. finish. <laughs> I mean yes. you, you need to yeah, get to yeah. an agreement and <laughs> what I would suggest you is that you decide, right? What each of you can investigate so that on Monday you put it together. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe it's two of you can investigate or think about the materials for the app and the other ones can be thinking about the device. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes, yeah, yeah. The necklace, um, maybe batteries. Um, so who's whatever. going to investigate what? Or who's going to yes. think about what? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay, so here we go. Final round. Communicate with each other, right? You already know that you have the group in WhatsApp, right? Uh, if you don't know one of your classmates phone number, you can write in the chat, hey, Blanca, send me a message. This is Gustavo. And then Blanca is going to contact you, right? So do that. Uh, now, uh, remember that you're going to investigate information and on Monday I'm going to give you some time for you to put together all the information, create what you're going to present or put it to or uh, organize it right and um, and then one or two people or everybody in the group are going to present. So every group is going to have approximately five minutes to make the presentation. Okay, now um, we're going to go on with the last one. So here we have the competition, right? So it's going to be easy, it's going to be fun. So all you, I need you to do is to have your camera on and your microphone ready. When it's your turn, you just activate it, right? And I'm going to be giving you the word. So, ready, Freddy? Antiseptic. Let's go on with the first one. So I'm going to do it according to the list, okay? I'm going to take the attendance. Beatriz and Mariela, are you there? I'm here. Yes, okay. Blanca? Okay. I'm here. <laughs> okay. 
Uh, next one is Diana. I'm Diego. here. Floor. I'm here. Francisco. Freddy. Presentation. Okay. Laura and Jackie. I'm here. Jennifer and Gustavo. I'm here. Excellent, Jennifer. Yes, I'm here. Okay, Miguel and Fabio. I'm here to share. Okay, Janari and Roxana. I'm here. Okay, Elizabeth is over there. So we continue with the last one. So, Roxana, you're the first one. How do you spell mm -hmm. hippopotamus? H. No, 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 I'm just kidding. Hippopotamus <laughs> was, was not in the list. Okay. I was thinking but, that. But you, but, you, but you have a good attitude. That's, that's important, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Hey, yes, I'm going to do it. So, uh, <laughs> let me see. I'm going to have the list next to the screen. Okay, the first word for you is purchase. E O R C H E. No. A S E. I'm sorry, that's not the comp the correct spelling. It's P U. So don't worry, R. be happy. Yeah. Next <laughs> one. Uh, quickly. The second word for you is opportunities. For me, okay. O double P O R T U N A. Ah, uh, teacher, I don't uh, concentrate it. Ah, I'm not I don't concentrate it. I wonder why. Okay, let's, you're what? thinking about the weekend. Yanari, don't worry, excellent. Class for her, please, reactions, okay. don't forget. Yanari, the first word for you is positioning. Positioning. Yeah. P. O S I T I O N I N G. Okay, positioning. The next word for you is disadvantages. Excuse me, what? Disadvantages. Um, disadvantage. You cannot look at the document, remember. It's just by memory. No, no, no. No, I'm just telling everybody, right? I don't Remember have... that you have to do it. I don't. <laughs> Teacher, what did you say? <laughs> no, I'm just reminding everybody, right? Camera ready? Just what you remember? Microphone ready, okay? So, disadvantages, D-I? I? I a G E S. Correct. Thank you so much. Fabio, you're next. How do you okay. spell targeted? Targeted. Um, T A R G E T E D. Okay. How do you spell furthermore? F U T H E R H E R D No E M O R E Almost sorry Almost. yes but the first one was okay Next one, Miguel, clap for Fabio, please. Miguel, the first word for you is brainstorming. Brainstorming, okay. Yep. Uh, B R A E M T O O R M 
E G no O M G almost but no second word for you <laughs> addition what excuse me uh, addition addition yeah um a d um e um no 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 a double d i d i o M. Correct. Okay, you corrected yourself at the moment, so that's okay. Gustavo, how do you spell idea generation? Idea generation. I D E. I wait, wait, wait. I D I A G E N E R I A. Sorry. Uh, T I O N. I think I was Very wrong close. in one. Only one letter, yes. Yes, one How letter. Do you yes. spell the word specificity? A specificity. S P E C I F I T N Y. Okay, uh, class for Gustavo, please. Jennifer, how do you spell threats? <laughs> Teacher, sorry, I couldn't hear. What did you say? Threats. T H E R T S. Close. Okay, how do you spell competitor? C O M. P E T I T O R S. Competitors, correct. Next, we'll have to continue with Jackie. How do you spell prototype? Class for Jenny. There you go. Prototype. Yeah. P R O T Y. P E. Oh, you forgot one letter. Okay, Jackie, thank you. The next Perfect. word for you is. Wait a second. Strength. Strength. S T R G H T S. Almost, almost. Okay, that was very close. Class for Jackie, please. Laura, are you there? I think she's not. No, we we'll continue with the next one. Quickly. Oh my God, we don't have time. Freddy. Bye. No, no, no. Freddy. Oh my God. <laughs> At least the semifinals are right now. Okay, Freddy's? Yeah. Okay, how do you spell target audience? Target audience. T A R G E T A U D I E N C E. Okay, how do you spell development? Development. D E V E L O P M E N T. Correct. Excellent. Class for him, please. Francisco, how do you spell launch? Francisco? Launch. Launch. Yeah. Launch. Mm, I would like to spell that. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> uh huh? Oh. Um, L C H um, is correct? No, sorry, it's not correct. 
How do you spell the word come up with? Come up with. Come up with. With. C O M O W E B. Close, oh. but no. Sorry, class for Francisco, please. Okay, due uh, to time, we're due to time. We're just going to do one more. Uh, so, Floor, are you ready? Diana is a volunteer teacher. Yeah, I know Diana once. Yeah, same same as Blanca. So, um, Floor, how do you spell? Yes. How do you spell a uh, manufacturing? <laughs> oh, teacher. Yeah. Um, M A N U F A C T U R I M G. Yes. How do you spell random? <laughs> R A M D O M. Yes, Diana. Everybody's waiting for you, Diana. <laughs> Tell me you're there. Okay. How yeah. about you are, teacher? How do you spell? I don't know. It's karma, I think. How do you spell appropriate? A P P R O P R I A T E. <laughs> okay. Yes, that's right. How do you spell the word? Um Branch. 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 E R A N C H. Yes. Okay, See? Blanca. I think that everybody's waiting for you too. I don't want to. Especially how do you Gustavo. spell good night? Okay. How do you spell sample? Sample. S A M P L E. Okay. How do you spell the word product testing? Product testing. P R O D U C T T E S T I A A N G. I N G. Okay, there we go. A uh, Beatriz. A A A A A N G. No, I'm sorry. It's I N G. No, I I I. Sorry, sorry, I am. Sorry, that's not, that was not the letter. Bad luck. Bad luck, yes. Beatriz, we finished with you. So how this, this is the semifinals. I'm, I'm going to tell you in the group who are the finalists and on Monday we have the finals, right? With the same list. So, uh, but more, more words. Beatriz, how do you spell the word uh, provide? P R O B I. Excuse me. P R O B I D E. Yes. Mm -hmm. How do you spell the word product line? P R O D U C T L I N E. Yes, that's correct. So, class for everybody. Have an amazing weekend. And I'm just going to. Teacher. Say... Hello. Thank Spell... you. Spelling Parangara Kutri Mikwaro. Ah, come on. <laughs> That's the spelling for the teacher. Okay. I will think about I will think about it. I will think about it. So uh, it was a pleasure to see you all again. Um Jennifer, because of time, I'm just going to stay with you for around uh four minutes. Is that okay? Yes? Okay, perfect. So five. Four or five minutes. Excellent. The rest of you. Good have fun. night. Have a good night. Night. Have a nice weekend. Have a nice weekend. Night, Happy weekend. Thank you. 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 Okay. So here we are. Sorry that you're feeling a little bit sick, um, Jennifer. Since when are you like that? Since yesterday or today? The microphone is off.
Your microphone is off. <laughs> no Since the last week, and I, I will have a doctor appointment tomorrow. Okay. Yes, but I have uh, several days without feeling any symptoms. But today, I don't know what, but I feel, uh, I feel really bad. I feel headache in in the night. In fact, I, I take a rest after I disconnect from my job. And but I take a pill and I start to feeling better. Okay. Yes. Um, you should be hydrating yourself. Um, drinking some serum like Sueto, you know. I'll that, tell you, I I, I get I got uh, sick because I don't drink enough water. Oh, so you got like Sometimes an infection. Sometimes I have a and I, for, I forget to drink, to drink water. So maybe what you can do is to set some reminders in your cell phone. Yes. Drink water. Or there's an app. I think there is an app that you can download that reminds you to drink water. Yes, I will try it. Yeah, there's an application about that. Teacher, okay. and I, I didn't expect that we will have the the accessory today but i just have those in the when we reduce the sentence or the statement mm -hmm. and change for an adverb can you please explain me okay so we reduce the adverb we reduce the adverb clauses so for the for reducing the adverb clauses we need to follow some steps we reduce an adverb class to an adverb uh, phrase. It's an adverb class because it has the elements of a sentence, right? It has a, it's a, it has a subject, it has a verb, a complement, etc. But uh, in an adverb phrase, we eliminate the subject and um, in the verb, we change it to ing form. So it's not exactly a verb, it's more a gerund. So for that reason, it's a phrase, it's not a clause, it's not a sentence. So uh, for that, we need to follow some indications, some rules or some steps. The first one is you can make a reduction only if the subject is the same person or the same thing in the two clauses, because we have independent clause and we have dependent clause. Yes? Okay. Yes, so, but what, what will you reduce? The first time that the subject appears or the second one? You reduce the one where the the preposition of, of time is. In this case, we studied the preposition of time. Before, after, when, while. Those are the ones that we studied. So in the clause, the subject where that is next to that, that is the one that you're going to eliminate. So if I say, before I go to the store, I take a shower. For example, before I go, I go to work, I take a shower. So that's, those are two classes, right? Before I take, a, I, before I go to work, I take a shower. So before I go to work, that, in that case, in that class, before I go to work, I am going to eliminate that subject because it's, it's in the same class with the preposition of time before. So I eliminate that I. So in this case, what is the, the rule? I eliminate the subject I, and if it is a normal verb, I am going to add ing. So before I go to work, before eliminate I, before going to work, comma, I take a shower. So you, okay, you and don't in change. this example where I was studying, I stay with my relative with the relatives with my then with the relatives of my best friend mm -hmm. so in this case uh, when i or you say while right now yes well while, I, was while I was studying, studying. so in this case we eliminate i okay. and if we have any form of the verb b we are going to eliminate that too so okay. In this case, we eliminate I and was. 
And okay. you don't modify the verb because it's already in the ing form. Ah. So you say, while studying, I oh, stay with the relatives I, of my BFF. Yeah, I stay with the relatives, with my BFF relatives. Yeah, exactly. Okay, I will try it because I stay in one exercise because I tried in different forms, but all the time was growing in the platform. Uh huh. And sometimes it's the punctuation because when the the preposition of place or time in this case before etc. It's, it's at the beginning. You need to use a comma in the middle of the two clauses. Uh, and I was trying to period. ask because, uh -huh. because every maybe everyone was past that. Uh huh. But but I haven't do it because of that. Okay, so I recommend you to what I, I mean. Were you present in the in the class where I made the review of the units one and two? So, sorry. Were you present in the class when, when I made the review of the units one and two? No. Last uh, uh, last Wednesday. Mm. The day before yesterday. I don't. I'm not sure if you were present, but if you were, if you weren't, let's say. Uh, in that video, I explained, okay, uh, the platform, the exercises, and that was one of the ones that I explained because Juan Jose was asking questions about it. In what class, say, teacher? On Wednesday. Last Wednesday. Wednesday. Yeah, class. this past Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Okay, I will review that is, it. That Thank is you. called a review, I think. Midterm, midterm review. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Midterm yeah. review. Yeah, that's the session. Okay, thank you okay, so much. Okay, Jennifer, you're welcome. And thank you for staying. I hope you, you get better really soon, that this thank weekend you, you so can much. rest and that you're thank ready you. on Monday. <laughs> okay, yes, have a good I night. Have, take have care of yourself. Have a good weekend and take care of large yeah. rest. You too. And take care of yourself. Bye, I teacher. Will. Goodbye.